Hello fellow KSPers, this is Steve Lawyer and let me introduce you to my recovery plane. So have you ever had where you're flying a non-MechJeb mission and your Kerbinaut just does not land exactly at KSC? Of course you have, it's hard to do isn't it? So the purpose of this craft is rather than do the unsatisfactory going to the tracking station and just recovering that uh, vessel that has landed off of KSC, this craft, this recovery plane is a VTOL airplane that allows you to go anywhere on Kerbin and pick up that splashdown or landed uh, craft that has come back from orbit. Uh, as you can see, it is VTOL. It follows my perfectly balanced build uh, techniques that there's a training video for. You can click a link to my training videos at the end of this video. You can also click a link to download this uh, craft file. Now, in this video, you can see I've done a VTOL takeoff. Um, I'm flying, uh, doing a buzz job past the tower. Uh, this is uh, Maverick uh, Tower requesting a flyby. Negative Maverick, the pattern is full. And of course, here we go, doing our flyby. Um, you can try to land this uh, craft directly down on top of a capsule. You'll see me try to do that here in this video. The reason why I don't succeed is I have the landing gear down. And if you're going to land on a relatively thin capsule and pick it up with the grabber, you've got to have the landing gear up or else the landing gear will touch. So you'll see here as I try to pick this up, my aim's pretty good. It's tricky with jet engines, of course, uh, because they're a lot of lag in their throttle. But here I go. But I had my landing gear down and I just bounce right off of the uh, the pad there. So I go ahead and touch down and use the easier technique to pick something up. You'll notice that this aircraft has no nose landing gear. Uh, you'll see that here in just a second. And the purpose of that is to allow you to land next to what you want to pick up. And if it's relatively flat, you can just drive right over the top of it bring up the, the four landing gear, lower down, and grab it uh, with the grabber. There's action keys to switch on and off your forward thrust and vertical thrust engines and to retract and extend uh, your claw. So here we go. We've just driven over the top of this capsule. Uh, we're picking it up with the grabber. Don't have to be exactly centered. Uh, you, If you use the free pivoting feature of the claw, you can be way off center because the item will swing to its natural center and uh, won't throw your craft off balance. So then here you can see we're going to do a uh, VTOL uh, takeoff. Here I've not free gimbaled the claw, so there's a little bit of a tendency of the craft that want to lean to the right, but it flew fine. And here we are, we're coming back and we're landing at the hangar. The, the vessel you see there in the background is a really neat aircraft. Uh, that is a, a space plane. Um, it is also VTOL capable when it lands in the vertical position. And it is able to go nonstop from Kerbin to the moon, land on the moon, and come back to Kerbin. There's a video of that if you'd like to see it. So there you go. Here's my recovery plane. Feel free to download it. It comes with instructions. Uh, it allows you to go pick up. Uh, any splashdown vessel anywhere you want. Uh, it's a completely stock craft. Of course, you can attach Mech Jeb to it if you want. And until next time, keep the blue side up.